All right, I'm going to show you guys how to properly take care of your bow. Make sure everything's working right. So first, what you want to do, um, after every couple of shoots, you need to check your cams. Because they have been known to chip to where your string will come off and the blow up in your face, which isn't a good time at all. It's had it happen. <laughs> and then limbs. Always check the limbs for cracks. You'll be able to see them normally. Or you can take a magnifying glass to it. Then you'll definitely be able to see it. Check the riser. Risers you don't usually don't have an issue with, but everything's good. Modules, make sure you check the modules. Modules will come loose a lot. Little bolt, it'll slip out. Really won't mess up anything, you'll be able to shoot it. And your draw won't be right, and it'll throw your arrow all over hell. And then, the biggest part about maintaining your bow is string wags. If you don't wax your string, it's not going to last very long. You wax it, you can make it last two, three years. That's the main thing. You put a little bit on there, rubber in, like so. You can kind of, you, you can kind of like over wax your bow, but you can't. It's not really going to hurt anything. It'll just look funky, it'll be all waxy. And then it just looks dumb. You just want to have enough on there to keep your stuff from. Basically, the wax just makes it to where stuff doesn't break. Because strings will fall apart by the little smaller strings that are all wrapped together coming apart. So, just rub it on there, all the way down the string, the best you can. You want to do this, a lot of people do it after every shoot. I don't. I do it whenever I get bored. I feel like waxing as I go. Or when I start seeing stuff breaking and then I decide it's probably not a bad idea to wax it. Or if you go out and it's raining, come home, wax it, wipe it down, all that stuff. Um, other than that, you just need to take a rag. Not real wet. I usually rub some wax into it just to do it, I guess, really, just to get it off my fingers. But I feel like it definitely helps. And then you just rub your stuff on here, clean it all off. You know, ain't got to be perfect, but keep the dust off of it. Also, try to keep it out of hot areas. I can't remember the exact temperature, but if you keep the bow in your like trunk or something if it gets too hot it'll expand the uh, I don't even know what the hell it's called I don't know it'll expand some stuff in the thing and then you'll have oxygen that'll get into your bow and like the molecules <laughs> or molecules in the carbon because it spreads when it gets hot so definitely don't leave it in your car Check your stabilizer, make sure it's tight, obvious one. Um, make sure your drop, if you guys got the drop away on here, make sure your uh, drop aways string is tight. Sights, make sure all the shit's not loose. Um, these uh, kisser buttons happen to come off a lot, so I always check that after, I check it every time I shoot because I shot and it hit my sight, came back, got me in the ear one time. It's so. D loops, they come off a lot, like very often, because people don't know how to time worth the crap. And that's about it, I feel. Good luck. Don't ruin your stuff.